Boy, do I have a plus size bathing suit Timu haul for you. If you're interested, keep watching. Hey friends, it's Kelly M. Welcome back to Mama Needs a Gold. Thank you so much for joining me today. And if you're new here, welcome, welcome. So friends, today I am in my bedroom. I am going to be doing a Timu haul for you for plus size bathing suits. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, I bought about, I think it's eight bathing suits and a couple pairs of just the bathing shorts. Um, I did this last year and I know a lot of you were interested in it. The problem that I had with the suits that I bought last year, I am a plus size on top and I'm like a large to an extra large on the bottom. So the plus size tops of the bathing suits, um, some of them fit me, some were too small, I should have went up a size, but the one tops that fit me, the bottoms were so huge, there's no way I could have worn them. So I had a lot of you reach out to me that have watched last year's video and say buy the swim shorts that they sell by themselves, and then buy the bathing suit and um, see if you compare them put them together and make a suit out of it. These suits are so, 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 so inexpensive that I can afford to do that. And many of you will be able to afford to do that. I'm, I'm telling you, friends, I'm going to put up on the screen right now um, the amount of items that I bought. I believe it was eight bathing suits, four swim shorts, and I'm going to put up right here the total of everything that I purchased. These bathing suits do come in regular sizes as well. Um, so for those of you that are not plus sizes, please go ahead and check it out. So what I'm going to do is take every item out of the bag, try on the swim shorts first just with my top just to show you how they fit me and I'll let you know what size they all, all are right on the bottom of the screen when I do that, the name of it. But don't worry, links will be put in the description box so you can easily find it. Um, what I paid for it and everything like that and then I would try the bathing suits on as is and then whatever shorts fit me the best I will put th those shorts on with the bathing suit top if it fits and we'll see what it looks like so there's going to be a lot of going on right here but um, let me go ahead get everything set up and then we'll go over everything and we'll see how they fit all right my friends so this is my Timu haul I have eight bathing suits and four pairs of bathing shorts. All right, my friends. So first I forgot to mention, um, my order came in two bags and they came in just these white bags. They didn't come in the Timo, Timo, Timu orange bags. Um, they came in just plain white bags. So if you're looking for that orange bag, it may not be in there. Um, we're going to start with the bathing shorts first. And um, I'm going to go over each one from my least favorite to my favorite. And then we'll go ahead and try on the bathing suits. So the first one I have here, this is black. It's like a little um, skirt, skirt, I guess. It is an XXL. This is my least favorite one, though I do like the looks of it. If you don't have a big of a belly as I do, it might fit you better. Um, what I didn't like about it, it has this waist thing in here. It's, I don't know if it's supposed to give you some, I don't know, but it, it's curling over a little bit. And honestly, um, you won't see it if you have a longer top one. I just didn't care for it. I just felt like it wasn't sewn right. Like it's uneven or something. Like it's, I don't know if you can see this or not. Let's see if we can do this. Like you can see where it's less there's more black here and then there's more white going over i just didn't care for that um i didn't feel like it gave you any kind of tummy help i did like that little what do you call this squishing squishing what is that called squishing i don't know whatever that's called you know what i'm talking about where you can pull the string and make it tighter or you can just pull it down and have it longer um i think if my tummy wasn't as big as it is um, this might look a lot better on me, maybe when I lose a few pounds. Um, I've been on a, I don't want to call it a diet, but life-changing um, eating habits. And um, this might fit me a little bit better down the road. I don't know. We'll have to see. I think I might hold on to it because of the cost. It was so inexpensive. I think I may hold on to it just because um, it may fit me better. We'll see. The next one is, this is a size XXL. And this is like a little squirt. 
like that. This one was not too bad. The band around the waist was kind of, um, it's thick and all, but I wanted something a little bit thicker just on the tummy part. So I didn't feel that it was that flattering on me around the stomach. Um, but overall, that's my only complaint about it, honestly. Um, I just didn't think it was overly flattering on me, but it was very comfortable, um, very well made. And like I said, price is going to be going up on the bottom of the screen. So this is in black as well, and I think I mentioned that it's an XXL. And now I went a little bit different. This is a size extra large, and it's a navy blue, and it's the little, are they called boy shorts or something? Now this is just the thin little waist here. It doesn't have the wide band or anything, and I thought, oh, I'm not going to like these. But I actually did like them. Um, they fit well. They're almost like wearing my workout pants, to be honest with you, my little workout spandex that I wear. They are not overly, they do have like an inside here with an extra layer for a tummy tuck. It's not super great as far as tummy tuck goes, but it helped a tiny bit. But I didn't think they looked bad, so um, yeah, I didn't think they looked too bad. Um, and I did blue because I do have a few bathing suits that has blue in there. And I thought I could change it out with the blue and the black maybe. And see, um, you know, kind of create two different looks. So again, this is a navy blue and it is a XL. And then the last one, the one that I like the most, this is a 1XL in black. And this is another little skirt. But can you see how wide the waistband is? I'll zoom in on that. Oops, I got to held up backwards. I'll zoom in on it so you can see how wide it is. I thought this was the most flattering on me. Let me know in the comments and tell me what you think, which pair of bottoms you like the best fitting on me. I just preferred this one. Um, that waistband is a little bit higher. Um, I just I just liked this one a lot better. I just thought the look was better and I thought it looked a lot better on me. So you'll have to let me know what you think. So what I'm going to do now is go try on the bathing suits for you all. I'm going to put on the suit as I purchased it, and then I will put it on either with the black shorts or the blue shorts um, or skort and see what you think with the top and the bottom. So let's go ahead and get that done. All right, my friends. So now we're going to go over the bathing suits. And um, I tried on the shorts with the bathing suit, like I said. I'm gonna add the picture up here of what it looks like with the shorts, and then what it looks like without the shorts. Um, I didn't mean that <laughs> without the shorts that go with this set, but the other shorts <laughs> that I bought. <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh, Lord help me. Um, but anyway, I am going to first start with the bathing suits that I did not care for and then work my way on up, okay? So first, we're gonna start with this one. This is in a size, and like I said, I'm gonna put the information on the screen and also um, it, the link. This is a size 4X navy blue, and I actually didn't mind the top of this bathing suit. That is the top, and that is the bottom. The only thing I had an issue with is it's see-through. Let's see. I don't know if you can see. Can you see me? There we go. Can you see me there? Um, I'm going to go ahead and put right up there what it looks like on. I didn't think it looked overly bad. It does have the removable pads here. Um, you can take them out. These are a little bit bigger than most of the bathing suits. So the, the, the pads that are in here are a nice quality, a nice size, good quality. Um, and that's the top part. That's the back. And like I said, um, I really liked the print on it. I thought this was solid when I ordered it. So I'm not sure if there is a solid one or not because sometimes the see-through patterns also has a solid one. Um, but I did like the fit of this. I just didn't like the fact that you could see my stomach. 
the shorts were a little bit too big on me um, which I knew was gonna happen but overall if you are bigger on the bottom these are nice shorts they are lined in the front so you have a little bit of that tummy um, protection there and it has a little bit of the thicker um, waist right there um, but I did like these with the navy blue shorts i didn't care for this with the black skirt shorts just because it was it was too long i think for that and i wasn't quite crazy about the way that looked i think this was the one yeah it was a little bit too long um but overall this is a very nice bathing suit for that because the overall fit is really, really nice, okay? Now, the next bathing suit I am extremely disappointed in because this was the favorite one of all that I purchased. I thought I was going to love because of the color. I love the bright colors. It's like a tank top. Um, I wasn't sure how I was going to like around the neck because I do prefer things that have a little bit of a V-neck. But the colors on this bathing suit is just absolutely beautiful the pattern it's got a little bit of green in there can you see that um, I just absolutely love the colors and it looks really good against my skin the problem that I had with this and I don't know if it would have fit or not once I got it on is that the inside it has the built-in bra um, these pads are removable. It has a little spot. You can take them out. But most of the bathing suits just has the front part of the bathing suit in it. This has it all around. And friends, I couldn't get it past my chest. My booze wouldn't go in it. And I could hear it starting to stretch and rip. And I tried and tried. And I thought, okay, Kelly, pull it on from the bottom. Step into it and pull it up. Again, I couldn't get it on, friends. I could not get it on. If it didn't have that piece on the back, I would have probably been able to get it on. But the other thing that I noticed, there are no adjustable straps, and that is probably where the issue came because I do have another bathing suit that has this in there and it has adjustable straps, and I was able to get it on with no problem. But I really, truly liked this. So Very disappointed in that one, friends, because the color was just absolutely gorgeous alrighty and then this bathing suit at first when I tried it on and you're gonna see right here I did not like it at all I had to have my husband adjust the straps for me he had just gotten home because um, I had already had it on and he's like yeah that's not overly flattering and then you're going to see in a minute where I figured out how to make it look flattering and I kind of like it. So this is the bathing suit. The straps has a v-neck. The straps are pretty wide. It has the little round circles here and then it has the adjustable straps. It does have the padding in the front. The pads on these are okay. They're not as big as I would like. It doesn't fill the whole area in. It does um, have the slot to remove it. I think I may um, invest in a good quality pad, maybe a set of two for my bathing suits and I can put them in there and change them out. Now, when I tried, let me show you the whole bathing suit first. Okay, and this I like. It has a little bit of a finished edge. It has a little black trim around the base of it. Most of the bathing suits are kind of just cut, but this actually is has a finished look. Um, but when I put it on first, oh, and the back of it is just straight across in the back. When I put it on first, and you're going to see in the picture, it just was not flattering across the chest. And then I tied it really tight and put it in a bell, which you will see. And then it just looked more flattering. And I, I think I liked it. Um, the pattern I'm not overly thrilled with. Um, but it doesn't look that bad once I put it on. And then the shorts were too big for me. Um, but both of the other shorts worked. I could do the navy or the black. Um, and you can see what these shorts looked like as well. Um, 
Alrighty, so the next bathing suit is this one here. I love, love, love the colors in that. There's some bright colors. It's just flowers all over. Back side, the straps are adjustable. You do need to be careful right here because this can slide out easily and you'll lose it. This bathing suit is a 3XL. Um, it does have the built-in kind of bra in the front with removable pads. It's not going across the back like that pink bathing suit I was telling you about or showing you. Um, just a little bit of a scoop neck on it. It is a little bit longer in the front, but I really, really like the top on that. I thought it fit well. The bathing suit bottoms were a little bit too big, um, but you know, if you're a little bit bigger on the bottom than what I am, I think they will work for sure. Um, I was very impressed with this bathing suit. Okay, and then we have this one here. I really liked this as well, but I got to tell you, it gets a little confusing with the back, and you're going to see in the picture here, the back gets twisted up, so you're definitely going to need to have somebody help you out a little bit, because it crisscrosses. You see all those crisscrosses? There's a lot going on there, but it is pretty. I do love the colors. It does have the padding. And let's see, they are removable as well. And I like the scrunch feature. I didn't scrunch it at first, and then when I scrunched it, it looked so much better on. So if you purchase one with the scrunch feature, do it with and without so you can see, because it really, truly made a difference. Um, right underneath the breast area, it has that little band. I wish that would have been a solid color and not the polka dots. Um, I would have liked to have that a dark navy because it kind of would have blended a little bit better under, you know, the chest. Um, but I, I'm not sure if I said, obviously these are adjustable. Um, but I did like the way this top fit. I thought it fit really, really well. And the bottoms of these, I thought this color was absolutely gorgeous. I don't know if I told you the size of this. It is a 4XL. But unfortunately, they were really huge. But I did like the bottoms of these. You may be able to find separate bottoms in this color. But like I said, those navy shorts that I bought um, will work beautifully with this. Absolutely beautifully with this. So I'm pretty pleased with this one. And now this one. This one is a little bit out of my comfort zone, believe it or not. Um... It's tighter and it's not flowy like these bathing suits and I just don't like things that are tight on me. I just feel very self-conscious, but I don't know, friends. Let me know in the um, description box what you think of this bathing suit on me. I really, really need your opinion. Um, there's just, it's something that's saying, Kelly, keep it. Um, but yet, um, I don't know. Let me know, friends, what you think. I'm going to put that up there. I love the little crisscross in the front right here across the chest. This has the built-in bra part that's on the back as well, like I mentioned, with the pink bathing suit. But the thing with this one is it has the adjustable straps. So I was able to adjust it to get it on. It was it, This one I just couldn't. And then you have the little ring in the front. Oops, let me get the bra part in. And these are, yes, removable pads. It looks like all the bathing suits have removable pads now. And then this is the design on it, and it ruches. That was the word I was looking for earlier on the other bathing suit. It ruches on both sides, so you can have it tighter or um, looser. And uh, I don't know, friends. Let me know what you think. I tried it on with the skirt. Um, this one I wasn't overly crazy about, but with the other skirt that I bought separate, I really liked it with that. Um, I don't know. I'm, I'm, let me know. That's what I keep saying. Let me know. Um, but this wasn't overly bad on me, to be honest with you. Um, it has like the built-in little tummy thing. I just like them a little bit wider up here than what this is, but it wasn't bad at all. And the underneath of this, you know, let's see underneath. So yeah, I, um, 
I don't know, friends. I need to hear from y'all and tell me what you think on this. But there's something that's making me say yes to this. I don't know why. <laughs> and then I have this one here. And this is similar to this one here. It has the ruching in the front as well. I just really, really like the colors in this. I thought they were really, really pretty. You got the thicker strap. And then when you turn it around in the back, you got a lot of this crisscrossing going on. And they are all adjustable. You definitely need somebody with you when you're working on this one. The pads inside are removable. I thought these were a little uh, too small um, for in here. So I definitely would get a bigger pad to go in there for sure. Um, but yeah, there's just I just really, really like the color of this a lot. I thought it was pretty. Very pretty. And then it came with these blue shorts. Was not a big fan of these because they were too big, but they're very much like the solid black ones that I bought. Um, or excuse me, not the solid but black, the solid dark blue ones that I bought. And as you can see, the blue ones... The blue ones um, with this really don't look bad at all. It's because it's such a darker blue. It almost has a black look. Um, these were a little bit too big, but again, I'm really happy with this as well. And then the last bathing suit is probably my favorite of all the fits. The design is very pretty. It's not my favorite design. I, w I would like something a little... I, I love the oranges and the hot pinks for the summertime um but there was a lot of blues out there for some reason um and i got this one and i thought this fit really really well it has the adjustable straps i really like the detail in the chest here it kind of comes down into a v and it's like sewn detailed down there um and then the back has like the thicker band right going across here. I just really liked it a lot. It has the uh, removable pads. And this, the shorts that came with these were too big. And friends, I'm not, I don't remember if I'm telling you sizes or not. The size of this is 3XL. These weren't overly large on me, but I think once they got wet, they would be too big for me. So I'm going to stick with my other shorts that I bought separate, but they weren't huge. So I do like that a lot. Um, this set, I'm not sure if I told you, I'll put it all on the screen. This is a 3XL and this other blue one here was a 4XL. So friends, that is all the bathing suits that I purchased. I will link last year's haul as well in the description box. Um, and hopefully there's something here that you like or I may lead you to something that you like. Um, I, I'm pretty pleased this year with what I found, especially since, since I bought the separate bottoms. That really, really made a huge difference for how these bathing suits fit me. And the cost of these bathing suits are so inexpensive. Um, you can afford to buy separate bottoms for it, you know, two or three pairs of them. So friends, that'll do it for today. Let me know what you think of the bathing suits. Um, you know, I'm being a little uh, vulnerable here showing you me in the bathing suits. So please be kind. That's all I ask. So thank you so much for joining me. I do appreciate it. If you haven't already, go ahead, hit that little subscribe button as it does greatly help me out. And also please check me out over on Facebook, Instagram, Pinterest, Twitter, and TikTok as I am active on all those social media sites as well. Thanks so much and I'll catch up with you next time. Bye.